Hi friends, welcome you all. Please subscribe my channel and press bell icon so that you can get update on time. So let's start. Now the question is what is network? Right? Network, uh, what actually the network is? If I am talking about network, 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 what is network? Right? Network is nothing. Network is a path to reach from one destination, one source to one destination. It's pretty simple like that. If you want to reach from Delhi, <coughs> from Delhi to Bangalore right via road you need to travel over the roads right that roads between Delhi to Bangalore is your network right if you go into the earlier days right if any king want to send the message to any king right what they will do they will they will use to send the messages through their horsemen, right? In Hindi, you can say that go, uh, they will have a god savar, right? They will take the message and they will run into the another kingdom and they will put give that message to the another king and take their message and deliver it to their own king, right? So, in a similar way, suppose you have given that given the message, right? You want to send the message. Uh, if you want to send the message to this king, right? If we are in our older days, what you will do, you will call your ho horseman, right? And write it down this letter and give it to them. And that horseman will take the map of this destination. Suppose this is in Bangalore, right? And this is in Delhi, right? So you should know how to reach Delhi to Bangalore, Bangalore right? If you don't know how to reach Delhi to Bangalore, you will never reach, right? So you need to take the map to reach Delhi to Bangalore. And you will go all over the road and reach the De Bangalore and give that message to that king and that king in reply give one more message and you just run all over the roads and reaches their own kingdom in Delhi and deliver that message to your king right the r so in this scenario the roads on which your horse will be run right you have traveled with your horse is your network between two kingdoms right and the person who has created the map for you to reach that destination is a protocol. Right? This is your actual message. And this horse is your way of transport. How you are going to reach. Maybe you can go without horse, right? Maybe you can use a bullock, bullock cart. That is the way of transport. Correct? So network is nothing, it's just a path to reach one source to another destination, right? It, you can say uh, it is it is a generic word which you can use for anything, right? It is not a particular re thing related to one router to another router, we build a network. Network is anything between Delhi to Bangalore, there is a network of roads, right? Which you can go, which you can use to reach from Delhi to Bangalore and Bangalore to Delhi, right? We have a railway network, we have a air network, right? We have a waterways to go some places from Delhi to or uh, from Mumbai to Goa and other places, right? That all are network between two source and destinations. So to build any network between any source and destination, we required some materials, right? To build a road, we required a concrete, road rollers and other machineries, right? So to build a network between two devices like two computers or two routers, we need a, some equipments, right? Ideally, why we are building an IP network? Because, because someone is sitting here with their own laptop or PC, right? And they want to access the another laptop or PC, server, anything, right? That is why we are building the network. Okay. To build that communication between two PCs, right? What we need? We need a devices called routers. Right? We need a devices called switches. We need a cables. We need a NIC card. And we need a firewalls as well. But in this course, we are going to learn how we can build a network between two PCs and two between one source and destination with the help of router switches and these cables, right? 
and we for security purpose we can use a firewalls these are some symbols which is globally used by all vendors to denote different different equipment for router we are using this symbol right if someone is talking about router if i am and even in this session if i am talking about router how how i will donate the router this is my router r1 right this symbol itself says that this is the router no need to write router every time right if i am donating making this symbol this is switch for me right this is switch so likewise this is for atm switch this is for bridge this is for server this is for isdn these are the generic symbols which are using throughout by different different network administrators even every vendor will using these symbol in their books and documents right thanks guys thank you for watching my video hope you will enjoy and you will get the knowledge from that also please do not forget to subscribe my youtube channel and press bell icon so that you can get the update on time also i am giving my whatsapp channel whatsapp group link and telegram channel link in a description so you can join that so that you can get a lot more study material